Good morning, everyone. How are you? Ha, still remember Miss Tiffy, right? Okay, so today we are going to learn a new topic. But first, teacher need to ask you. Teacher nak tanya. Alright, so class, how are you? I am fine, teacher. Maksudnya, awak sehat. Teacher, I am not well. Maksudnya, teacher, saya tak sehat. Hmm, so, which one is it? I am fine or I am not well. Okay, let me hear you. Okay, you got your answer. Right, so we go to the next one. Okay, for today, we are going to learn a new topic. Okay, unit 5. Moving forward. Okay, open your textbook, page 41. Okay, those who does not have textbook, it's okay. You just uh, look at the video. Okay? Alright. Okay, look at the picture. There are 5 circles, right? Okay, there are 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5 circles. Alright, what do you see? Okay, before teacher continues, sebelum teacher sambung, I want you to think and see and tell teacher what do you see. Come on, you can do it. Done? Alright, you don't know? It's okay, teacher will tell you. Alright? Okay, circle number one. What do you see? Okay, there are children, right? Okay, what are they doing? They are using the tablets. Follow teacher. They are using the tablets. Ha, nampak tu? There's tablets on the table, kan? Ha, okay. Before teacher go on, teacher want you to look. Why teacher put color there? Those who did my homework, you must, you should remember. Okay, you should remember. Teacher put four colors. In one sentence must have these four things. Apa dia teacher? Okay, green, you must start with capital letter. Dalam ayat awak, kena ada capital letter. Awal-awal, green colour there. Okay, and then yellow, subject. Subject tu siapa? Orang lah, orang ke, benda ke. Okay, so they, they tu diorang kan? Ha, okay, are using, are using is for verb, warna orange. Okay, verb tu apa teacher? Kata Kerja. Okay, lepas you write all that sentence, you must have punctuation. Punctuation to remember, we learn other four. Ha, so, if you write uh, ayat, you must put full stop at the end of your uh, sentence. Okay? Understand? Okay, we go on to the next one. Okay, circle number two. What are the boys doing? The boys are playing games. Ha, okay. Do you see that? What are they playing game with? Ha, that thing, you call it PlayStation, right? Ha, okay, so they are playing games using PlayStation. Okay, teacher asks you, do you have PlayStation? How do you play your game then? Ha, let me know, okay? Picture number three, nampak tu. What is that? What is this? Ha, this is an e-book. E-book tu apa, teacher? Good question. E-book ni, it's like a uh, book, buku, book that you can find online dalam internet. So, contoh, uh, you read comic, uh, you read a storybook, but in the internet. So, we call that and ebook okay okay next one okay what is this ha huh. this is an atm machine okay where do you see this can you tell me where di mana where do you see this at the bank right okay atm machine what is it for untuk apa teacher ha huh. atm machine is for you to Put your money or save your money or for you to take out your money. Okay, maksudnya untuk awak simpan duit atau keluarkan duit awak. If, 
if you save your money in the bank then you can use the machine to take out your money if you don't save then you cannot take out your money lah betul tak right uh, so we call this an ATM machine okay okay last one what is this uh, this is a GPS navigator uh, GPS navigator apa tu means it's like uh, Waze you know Waze Google Map in your phone too right but uh, there's also a machine where we call it a GPS navigator where you put it in your car and then you get to use the map to tell you where to go macam sekarang like nowadays your car uh, some cars have GPS navigator you know the screen in the middle of the car yang tengah-tengah kereta tu Okay, that thing, uh, got some cars ada GPS navigator. So, what is it for? It's for you to find your way to wherever you want to go. Ke mana awak nak pergi? So, you use that uh, to to follow lah. Okay, follow where you want to go. Uh, navigator pun uh, take you. Dia akan beritahu. Okay, go left, go right. Uh, right. Okay. Do you have it? Because uh, I do. Okay, can you remember what were the pictures? Okay, try to tell teacher, try to tell me what do you see in the pictures? Okay, remember there were five pictures, five je. Okay, try to tell me what are the pictures? You can do it. Okay. Do you still remember? There are three uh, machine. Remember? And then two picture. People play with a uh, gadget. Alright, time's up. Okay, if you have tell me what the pictures are, well done. Good job. Okay, you remember, well done. But those who don't remember, it's okay. You can go back and then you read the video again. Okay? Alright. Okay, for the next lesson. Okay, for the next lesson, we are going to read. So, what you have to do is listen to teacher first. Okay? Listen and then you follow. Okay? Right. So, open your textbook, page 44. Okay, those who do not have textbook, it's okay. Teacher have prepared for you and the text for the next, in the next slide. Okay? Are you ready? All right. Okay, today we are going to read about electronic books. The future of reading. Okay, listen first, then you follow teacher. Okay, are you ready? Okay, one, two, three. Electronic books or e-books are electronic versions of printed books. They can be viewed on a computer screen or on an electronic book reader. Okay, faham? Maksudnya, electronic books or e-books are electronic version, versi electronic of buku bercetak printed books. They can be viewed on a computer screen. Dia boleh ditengok atau dibaca melalui computer screen or on an electronic book reader. Book reader tu apa teacher? Gambar tengok tadi tu lah. Kita panggil book reader. Ha. Okay. Now kita nak ke passage ke dua. Passage number two. Okay. Are you ready? One, two, three. E-books can be purchased on the internet from publishers or bookstores. We can only pay for these books using credit or debit cards. 
purchasing an e-book is faster compared to purchasing a book from a bookstore. Ha, maksudnya dia kata e-books can be purchased on the internet. Purchase, beli. Okay, on the internet from publishers or bookstores. Bookstores tu kedai buku. So, we can only pay for this book. Kita boleh bayar these books ni using credit or debit cards. Menggunakan credit or debit cards. Do you have credit or debit cards? Hmm, teacher have. But do you? Ha. Okay. Purchasing an e-book is faster compared to, ha, dia kata beli e-book ni dia lagi cepat berbandingkan purchasing a book from a bookstore daripada awak membeli buku daripada bookstore. Kenapa cepat? Because purchasing e-book ni faster because you can buy anywhere. Ha, kita go baca dekat bawah pula. Okay? Nanti you will know why. Alright? Okay, are you ready? Okay, one, two, three. Nowadays, more people are choosing to read e-books. This is because the materials can be downloaded and accessed anywhere. E-books are also environmentally friendly because they reduce the number of trees being cut. Ha, panjang tu. Okay. Teacher translate satu-satu untuk awak. Okay. Dia kata, nowadays, more people are choosing to read e-books. Uh, more people are choosing, lebih uh, memilih untuk membaca e-books. Why? Why, teacher? Why? Because the materials can be downloaded. Okay, dia boleh di-download and access anywhere. Boleh dapat bila-bila masa di mana-mana jua. Okay. Then, dia kata, E-books are also environmentally friendly because they reduce the number of trees being cut. Ha, sebab e-books ni, awak cuma membaca through a screen, kan? You turn on the internet and then you read. So, tak no need to cut trees. Am I right? So, reduce the number of trees being cut. So, awak baca e-books. If you read e-books, meaning there will be no more trees to cut to make books. Because books made of papers. Papers come from trees. Right? Ha, okay. Do you understand? Can I go on? Okay, alright. Last one. Last kali. Okay. Follow teacher. One, two, three. The future of e-books is bright. It allows us to bring the whole library with us wherever we go. They are slowly gaining popularity because of its convenience. Ada kata, the future of e-books is bright. Masa depan e-book ni very cerah. Okay, so it allows us to bring the whole library. Dia boleh membolehkan kita bring, bawa the whole library ni with us. Wherever we go, ke mana-mana saja kita berada. Ha, okay, so they are slowly gaining popularity because of its convenience. Maksudnya, dia sekarang ni, e-book ni, dia tengah capai sikit-sikit popularity tengah famous sikit-sikit tengah uh, popular lah because dia punya kebaikan dia dia punya faedah dia tu ok senang apa dia ha, just now we say uh, dia pay pakai debit and credit card ha, the purchase of ibu is faster these materials can be download and access anywhere ha, banyak lagi you understand? Can you answer the question after this? Ha, so, this is your homework for today. Ha, congratulations! If you have followed teacher, read the text together, you listen and you understand, congratulations! Well done! So, now teacher can proceed with your homework. Okay, let's see what's your homework for today. Okay, answer these questions. Okay, what I want you to do is, okay, take out your E2 book. Okay, if you don't have E2 book, you can use paper. Okay, 
I want you to write ni write all this one, two, three, four question in your e two book, and then you answer. Where's the answer, teacher? Ha, answer to the card text yang kita baca tadi, the one that we read just now. Okay, everyone, okay. Alright, so that is the lesson for today. Thank you, and I will see you next week.